And welcome again. This is Britt Taylor, FSPA president, and we're coming to you live with the secret bonus at home digital contest winner announcements that we will start in just a couple minutes. near fatal interruption from the interior house crew. I guess I didn't get my plans authorized by the boss, but again, we were just a couple of minutes away from giving you live at home digital contest winner announcements. That will start shortly. Alex, good to see you back in the chat room. All right, the chat room's starting to build. I can tell you guys missed us. Ah, it's touching, thank you. And we will get started in two minutes. And one more time, this is Britt Taylor, FSPA president, welcoming you to our secret bonus edition of At Home Digital Contest winners. We will be starting in one minute, announcing all of the winners from our At Home Digital Contest that happened a couple of weeks before virtual convention. All right, I think it's time. And again, one more time, Britt Taylor here, FSVA president, welcoming you to our announcement of our at-home digital contest winners coming to you live from the FSPA virtual porch um, because maybe my wife kicked me out of the studio so she could teach her kindergarten class, but it's okay. Uh, you know, just like fourth quarter for everybody, we're rolling with the punches here and we're ready to go. So let's get this thing started. All right, in our first category, we have Britt Taylor from Haggerty High School with a picture of Archie. Excuse me, Britt, Britt. I, yeah, I don't know how you managed to get that into the PowerPoint. What, you, that wasn't the winner? Well, your dog is, um, is adorable, but, uh, but Archie did not win the pet photo. Oh, man. I'm sorry. Why did I, you know, I, you, you told me to come show up and that this is the treatment I get. All right, fine. Let's get on to the real stuff then. All right. We'll find out who won the real pet photo here in just a few minutes. But first, let's start with game review. We had 22 categories, a lot of winners from all over the state. So game review, honorable mention, Carson Yor from Lake Brantley High School, Abigail Parker from Bishop Kinney High School, and Jalen Ball from Hillsboro High School. Third place, Ethan Hutchinson from Steinbrenner High. Second place, Leah Luderman from Haggerty High School. And the winner, Natalia Pallas from Coral Gables Senior High School. Congratulations. In cooking demo, honorable mention, Alejandra Correa from John A. Ferguson Senior High School. Third place, Chase Parada and Robert Becker from Cooper City High School. Second place, Lucas Figueroa from Gulliver Preparatory School. And first place cooking demo, Marcus Caligari from Christopher Columbus High School with chicken parmesan. Middle school cooking demo, honorable mention, Elizabeth King from American Heritage Boca del Rey. Third place, 
the team from Doral Academy Middle School's Firebird TV. Second place, Julia Frances from Gulliver Academy Middle School. And the winning middle school cooking demo, Priscilla Custodio, Ashley Gutierrez, Jacqueline Gutierrez, Doral Performing Arts and Entertainment Academy with churros. In photo story, honorable mention, Zoe Craig, Wharton High School. Third place, Joanne Hayner from American Heritage Plantation. Second place, Anna Corral Galavan from Steinbrenner High School. And the winning photo story, Cindy Vega from Gulliver Preparatory School. In middle school photo story, first place, Jaden Woolard, American Heritage, Boca del Rey. And an advisor photo story where we challenged our teachers to, play, to compete. Honorable mention, Kim Pecala from Coral Springs Charter School. Third place, Michael Malcolm Bjorkland from Columbia High School. Second place, Susan McNulty of J.W. Mitchell High School. And first place, Carlos Gonzalez, Somerset Oaks Academy. Congratulations. Public service campaign, honorable mentions to Rebecca Lalama of Moss at Zelda Glazer and Ashley Ulbrich of American Heritage Boca del Rey. Third place, Laura Blanco from Doral Academy High School. Second place, Daisy Hatcher and Gabriela Reyes from Gaither High School. And first place public service campaign, George Eccolino and Megan Fino and Bradley Schimmel, pardon me, Schimmel from American Heritage Boca del Rey. Congratulations. This category required participants to design a poster, make a video and make an audio ad. Later today, we will have all of the links to the winners online so you can check out the actual work in greater detail. Next up in podcast, honorable mention, Isabella of Gio and Sofia Villa from Moss at Zelda Glazer. Third place, Kenny Dones, Coral Gables Senior High School. Second place, Alexis Vivanco, Juan Carlos Choi, Omar Saman, from Christopher Columbus High School. And first place in podcast, Brian Becker, Josh Hafis, and Brecken Mayer of Cooper City High School's CTV. Congratulations. In package editing, honorable mention, Olivia Bird, Vieira High School. Third place, Megan Sullivan, Sickles High School. Second place, Josh Hafis and Trevino Amore from Cooper City High School. And the winner in package editing, Alexander Samilian, Lucas Guerra, Andrew Falcone, Christopher Columbus High School. In profile writing, honorable mention, Harika Guvidari from Steinbrenner High School and Emma Deal of J.W. Mitchell High School. Third place, Allie Massey of Wharton High School. Second place, Hayden Turner of Haggerty High School and first place, Maddie Stout of the McClay School. Congratulations. In Literary Magazine Spread, honorable mention, Jordan Deese, Steinbrenner High School. Third place, Aaron Moffitt, Natalie Ulm, and Chloe Aikman, HB Plant High School. In second place, Grace Bielman, Steinbrenner High School. And in first place, Olivia Martin Johnson of Gulliver Preparatory School. And here's a look at the winning spread. In live talk show, third place, Ellie Barnstein, Logan Brown, Skylar Burris, and Zach Simon, American Heritage, Boca Del Rey. In second place, Ethan Mazel, Joey Sasani, Harrison Kremsky, and Jacob Bennett, American Heritage Plantation. And in first place for live talk show, the staff of CTV, Cooper City High School. In hand-drawn illustration, honorable mention, Aliza Chazen, American Heritage, Boca del Rey, and Malia Copeland, Hillsboro High School. Third place, Maria Arazamena, Wharton High School. Second place, Alexandra Gerges, Steinbrenner High School. 
And in first place for hand-drawn illustration, Maria Gonzalez, Doral Academy High School. Here's a look at the winning work. In editorial writing, honorable mention, Sam Grisjelli of Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School, Daniel Toll, Coral Gables Senior High School. Third place, Jessica Maldonado, Haggerty High School. Editorial second place, Ellie Castile, the McClay School. And editorial writing first place, Marin Fell, the Red and Black, Hillsborough High School. In middle school COVID spread, the uh, Vera Lepresti of Gulliver Academy Middle School. In part of the interruption, one of our favorite games to play at convention, we took it online this year. Honorable mention, Rick Vasquez and Brandon Vasquez of West Broward High School, WBTV. Third place, Marcos Gonzalez and Stevie Jimenez of American Heritage, Boca del Rey. Second place from Christopher, I'm sorry, pardon me, Christopher Gomez and Benjamin Cure of Christopher Columbus High School. And the winners, Alexander Similian and Kevin Reyes, Christopher Columbus High School, CCNN Live. In flash fiction, honorable mention to Maria Arazamena from Wharton High School and Ali O'Connor of Steinbrenner High School. Third place, Katie Matthews, Freedom High School. Second place, Tatiana Batista, Coral Gable Senior High School. And in flash fiction, the winner, Christy Cadet, Coral Glades High School. For news anchor, honorable mention, Maria Borg Borges of Moss at Zelda Glazer High School. Third place, Christopher Gomez of Christopher Columbus High School. Second place, Alexander Similian from Christopher Columbus High School. And your winner and news anchor, Marcelo VR Ojito of Doral Academy High School's Firebird TV. For COVID yearbook spread, honorable mention to Braylon Lamb and Anand Aya Hardeman from Columbia High School. Third place, Bridget Hahn, Haggerty High School. Second place, Jaden Martin, Alexis Steinberger, Holy Trinity Episcopal. And for winning first place yearbook spread, Chloe Evers, Jordan McKendrick, Madison LaCroix, and Julia Anzanito, University High School. Congratulations. In COVID newspaper spread, third place, Shreya Servanson and Amanda Cohen of the Dreyfus School of the Arts. Second place, Jessica Maldonado and Parker North, Haggerty High School. And in first place, Asher Montgomery, Marin Fell, and Carolina Tortorelli, Hillsboro High School. For broadcast show, honorable mention, the team from level four at Moss News, Moss at Zelda Glazer High School, and the crew of the rise of Doral Academy High School's Firebird TV. Broadcast show, third place, CTV, Cooper City High School. Broadcast show, second place, Rachel Clark, Ashley Pellicone, Evan Eisenstark, and em Emily Carbocci of Seminole Ridge High School, WSRN News. And in first place for broadcast show, the staff of the voyage, Christopher Columbus High School. For pet portrait, our final category and our most popular category, an honorable mention, Sabri Chambers of St. Cloud High School, Natalie Ulm of HB Plant High School, and Layla Musa of Coral Glades Senior High School. Pet portrait, third place, Morgan Brazier, Robinson High School. Pet Portrait, second place, Alexander Similian, Christopher Columbus High School. And first place, Pet Portrait, Jasmine Arocha, Moss at Zelda Glazer High School Edition. Congratulations. All right, I'm gonna turn it back over to Britt now. Thank you so much for joining us. 
All right, congratulations to everybody who entered and it was a great turnout for the at home contest and we're excited to see all those entries. And Joe, I know you're gonna need a, an hour or two off after all that reading. You're not used to all that talking during, a, during quarantine. So good job getting through those. All right, so let's talk about what's next for um, FSPA. So links to the winning entries are gonna be online later today. And you of course go to our website. Feedback's available now if you log in through betternewspapercontest.com just like you did for the spring digital. And then certificates will be coming to advisors via email soon digitally. Probably uh, next week. Probably next week. Okay. All right, look out for information on submitting yearbooks and literary magazines for evaluation soon. Again, you'll find that information emailed out to and coming through our website. And of course, as always, stay engaged with us on Twitter at FSPA and on Instagram at Florida Scholastic Press. And of course, stay safe. As always, we're looking back. We're looking forward to seeing you soon, hopefully in person. And until then, we're signing out. This is Britt with Joe. Joe. And Omar, producer, thanks, everybody. We'll talk to you soon.